Howdy, folks. Welcome back to the Alex Parker Road of the Show Series here in MLB 22 PS5. We suck. We suck. So, I'm tired of sucking. I know I said I was going to never do this, but I'm going to freaking do it. I'm tired of sucking. I'm taking away a contact perk, man. I'm putting in the... Uh... Wow, that's a really good perk. Oh, it takes away power. Screw that. I'm putting in a power perk again. I'm tired of not hitting tanks. <laughs> uh, it's not that I want to hit tanks. It's that I just don't hit it all now. So that's a boost of like 7 to our power. It's not going to make an effect immediately, but... It's going to make an effect. I'm really just tired of it. I, I, I just... <laughs> like, yeah, we have a freezing snowflake next door name. Because nothing goes anywhere. So we're putting a power perk back in. We'll see what it does in the long term. Alright. I don't even know what our power's at. Something like 75 or something now. Dad gum it, man! It ain't doing anything! It ain't do anything! So two down. So digging in now for I can't get a hit, man. I can't get a hit. Yes! Why didn't he catch it? Who knows? It's a double. <laughs> ball is crushed. It's an RBI double. Why did he not catch that? Was that not catchable? I guess not. 3-1 to Tatis. Padres now lead thanks to an Alex Rope. Come on, Nando. Middle of the third. So two down now, and here is Carlton Williams. Good contact guy, good defender. Bounced up the middle. Parker handles the chance, and that is that. Here's the center fielder, Steve Gibbons. One down, base is empty. We're all over that. Parker. You gotta get it over there, Alex. Dang. Take your time, though. We're one for two here today. Oh, there's a second hit. Alright. I mean, this is better than last time, so... What's there to be mad about? Tatis is 0 for 2. We need some more runs, man. This is a stretch where we're facing teams with losing records. We've got to beat them. I'm talking a one series, every single series. If we can win every series, I see no reason why we wouldn't be in the playoffs. Tatis does not come through again. This kind of has been better in the last two weeks or so. Two or three starts. He's off to a good start today. Four scoreless. That's up the middle. We're not getting there. That was a terrible reaction time, though. Good to see Adam in their lineup. It's two to two. And now it's going to be Alex Parker. A guy who makes an impact not just at the plate, but also Yeah, we were out in front of that one. And he takes it himself for the out. Now at the plate, Alex Big spot. Parker. We're two for four. Tied at fours. That was an awful swing. If you're a base runner, you got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. Next pitch misses outside. One and one. Huh, no outs. A walk here would move a runner to second. That'd be big. And, and I've swung at two balls now. Two strikes. May see some movement over there at first base. Try to stay out of a double play here. Got him. One's on here. That honestly, that at bat was just completely on me. 
And we lost. Yeah, this season is hopeless, man. We suck. Alex Parker will hit next. Jack Leiter. Enters the day among the league leaders in batting average, but he'll need to get hot if he hopes to win the title. In there, and it's 0 1. Well, impressed that he went right after him on that first pitch. That's the key. Try to get ahead in the count, and you can play around a little bit more as the bat expands. No score just getting started, top of the first. Next one misses. Now two balls and a strike. Ground ball right side. He takes it himself to the bag, and that'll do it. Next for Colorado, Henry Davis. Three nothing. The pitch. Out to short. And he's out. Alex Parker, the next to hit. We're a little out in front of everything. Lighter checks on first. Park dives back So in let's safe. figure that out. Right now I'm just fighting for a 200 hit season, man. Dang. Back fighting for a 30 first. home run He's season. That time as well. Never done that. I've always been well above 30. In the dirt. Oh, no. Well done behind the dish. Lighter with a move to first. Park back easily. Hey, you got it. And a 1 0. Let's go. And that's in for a strike. 1 1. Park, the base runner at first with one out. Next pitch is in the dirt. And a count 2 and 1. Welcome back, Power Perk. That is gone. Absolutely smacked. 5 nothing, Padres. Come on, man. Cuidado, piso mojado. We got to get... We got to get up there in the homers. There's number 26. It's three RBIs already on the day. So that's good. A five-run lead. Oh. Third to third. And he'll be safe at first. We weren't getting anybody, but that's two one, and it's five to four. Wow, they came back so quick. This guy wanted the best Alex went deep last time. As well, outstanding on the defensive end. First offering misses the mark. And the pitch. That's hit deep. The power perk is back, and it freaking works. No, man, stop doing that. I hate the ground rule double, man. That's an outdated and stupid rule. Like, dang, whatever bag you're, like, the next bag out. Yeah, it's hard to figure out, you know. But, like, that run should score. Let's hit relatively deep. Gibbons has a beat on it. He's throwing to the cut, so we'll run to third. It's six to four. Tatis drives one in. The one that I should have drove in. Me. Come on, Meadows. I'm happy to have my power perk back, dude. I feel like this is going to be way better. Meadows puts plenty on that. Alex tags. It's a 7 to 4 game. So we add on a couple more. Sam Davis trying single handedly to blow this. Did he. Uh, one of those runs is not on him. We get back to it. End of the sixth. Alex Parker, the next up for the Padres. Phil Chassin, the pitcher. Still, and we smack that as well! It's off the wall. 
It's a two-out double. What is going on? Safe at second with a double. Third hit for him this afternoon. Yeah, this is so much better. <laughs> it's our 50th double of the season. The hit here will give us a three-run lead. Already two doubles, three RBIs, a homer. Tatis sends us home. Let's go, man. The other way with that one. If he wasn't called down for like a whole month, he'd be your MVP. Even though Kellenic is crushing the ball. But that's number 36 for Tatis. Back here at Coors Field. And stepping in is the speedy Alex Parker. That's gone! Yeah, man! Yeah! Let's freaking go, dude. This is amazing! 10 to 5. It's our 27th of the year. Let's freaking go. Get that slugging back up, man. Four for five day, two homers and two doubles. Sam Davis actually struck out 10. And we get the win. Come on. That's freaking awesome. Jaden Hill pitching. Leads the league in batting average with only a handful of games left on the schedule, closing in on a batting title. Now I'm aggressive. <laughs> I could get up to 80 power. If I go back to the Otani bat, I could get 81 power. Hater deals and now two and one. Two one. Chance for an RBI here, that'd be nice. Righty delivers. Fabble, fabble, fabble. And he grabs it foul. Next offering misses. That and is 3-2. Three, three, two. One out and a runner at second. That's disgusting. That's the that's the best pitch he could have made. Yeah, that was gross. Good power. Not great in the OBP department. Got to make a play here. Alex does, and it will be tied at the end of one. Now the Rockies catcher, Austin Wells. A backdoor cutter, man. That was gross. Bitsko's had some trouble with base runners here early. That's going to get both of them. Or, I'll be both of them out. Now, Darrell Whitaker. He's over one. Up next for Colorado, the third baseman, Darrell Whitaker. All right, Darrell. To the right side. Safe at first as they can't make the play. Alex Parker. That was goofy. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Okay. Sure. Hey, get a good one up there, huh? Kicks and fires. Whoa, that pitch is up. He really committed to that fastball up at the top of the zone. He knows that if he makes a mistake in the zone, it gets hit hard by a power guy like this. That's a nice miss right there. Oh, yeah, good change up. Breaking ball in there. I think we've been good against Shaden Hill in our career. No, six for twenty-three. We have hit two homers though. Either one, something off speed, good arm action on it, whatever it was. Next offering is downstairs. That's a really good take. I'm locked. I'm seeing it. 
And a pitch. Yeah, three two. Park on at first. Nobody out. Here you go, baby. Find a good pitch. And a I time that. I, okay, whatever. That was twice though. That's weird. That happened. Nobody on. Now it's the DH out of El Amador. Lost the contact perk. <laughs> So 113 contact. Hard ground ball base now. Two out hit. We do lead three nothing. So that's good. It's a simple ground ball the other way. They had eyes on it, man. Sometimes it's all you right back in the field. Ball travel. Put the ball in play and just hope it finds a hole. And you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats. Swing at a bouncer. Parker collects. Third out. Beautiful play. A little frame. flip. Little flippy flip. Parker, two out. Nobody on. Who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. They say you win. Oh, we I win. Okay. The weather and the umpires might be forced to make a Please don't strike me out again. Yeah, I think so, Boog. I mean, everyone looking and wondering when they're going to stop play. It definitely Back on my man. I'm going to strike out again. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm going to hit the ball. Deal 2. Ball one there. This is important. If he can go one, two, three here, it would be a very positive sign for him and for his team. Dang, I'm on it, man. What is going on? I'm not mistiming it. Oh, my gosh. We blew it again. And we fly out. I struck out three times, man. Makes the catch for the out. We won, though. Okay, I don't care. Whatever. We struck out three times in freaking F8 last one, but whatever, because we won. And that's really all that matters here. Um, a win is a win is a win is a win. Uh, what do we got here? A talk here because it's the end of the season. Hanging on by a thread. Yeah, I know. We did. We went to it. So we won the series. We're six and a half there. Half game here. Like I said, it's a tight wild card race. The Braves fell a full game behind us. D-backs are up next. We're still on the road. Every game is so, so freaking important from here on out. Oh, gosh, dude. Jeff Duncan's back. Jeff Duncan is back. This one's over. This is an automatic L. Jeff Duncan is terrible. He's really bad. And do you know why? Because he's got, I mean, he, he's he got good potential. He's young. Wrong one. But, he, I mean, he's got 45 hits per nine. That is truly the problem here. It's so sad. But, okay, Jeff Duncan, whatever. Cool jerseys. Let's hit. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Always tough to turn two on a speedster like this. It's even harder with him coming out of the left-handed batter's box. You really need something to hit hard on the ground that they can handle to turn two quickly. Oh, okay, O2. Next offering is in for a strike. I understand you want to try to gauge that guy's fastball, but you also have to be aggressive and ready to hit nope, in your zone. Now you're in a tough spot. Count one and two. One on, one out. It's not getting caught, right? He's getting there. Bird makes the catch. Two away down. This is a tough one to hit. Dustin Green stands in now for the Diamondbacks. The switch hitter batting right. Out to short. Parker gloves it. Gathers and throws to first. Two out. Two outs. Nobody on. Ivan Herrera stands in now for the Diamondbacks. The wind of the pitch. Out to short. Parker collects it. Rolls across the diamond. That's the third out. Inning over. Now it's the short. Oh, nice. All right, let's get a hit. Come on. And the first offering is not. Clap threw me off. We sure got three times last game. That is a rarity. The pitch. That might have been our first three strikeout game in a long time. 
doesn't get a swing. Not very often you see a hitter lay off a cookie like that. That's it into right center. It's caught. Racing makes the catch. And there's two down. Hey, Jeff Duncan, you look good right now. Just keep going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Why to kick the pitch? Bounced out to short. Parker picks it up to first. Yeah, they get the out. Good throw. Back here in the Two to one. We've really just had the one good game. Stepping in for San Diego, Alex Parker. And the first pitch misses for ball one. It's good speed at the top of the order. We're back to first in the NL on average. Maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. Good pitch. Next Not ours. Is in for a strike. Let's see if he's willing to use the whole field right here. Definitely pounding him away. The next pitch misses. Two and one. Right-hander kicks deals. Foul Good pitch. Off. I thought that was a fastball. If it was, that was getting hit. A wind in the pitch. It's been a tough going. Out of the last couple of games. Field. Oh, it's popped he out as well. To make the play. A nice running grab. And there's one away. Alex Parker will hit hey, this is where we turn it around. 0 for 3. In the sport. But two on, one out. Ah, we're on it. Looking for some insurance. Or as our friends down in the south would say. Insurance. No matter how you say it, we know what you mean. Left hand hitter waits. Come on it, man. I just can't hit it. High pitches do not want to go anywhere. At first, one gone. Bird on the move to his right. Nice grab on the run. That's out number two. Dang it, man. Behind on it. Center fielder, Alex McKenna. I can't get anything to fall, though. Jeff Duncan comes back and absolutely shuts me up. There is seven innings of one run ball. He might throw a night or an eighth. That is the inning. Hey, a win is a win if we win. It's five to one. All right, let's go one for five at least. Dang. We are 0 for six today, or five, whatever. Five one. Come on, Alex. <laughs> Come on, bud. Wake up. So two down. Next for the Padres, Alex Parker. This guy, one of the best contact men in the sport as well. Outstanding on the defensive end. The 0-1. These two guys, a lot of respect for one another. Here's a 1-1. Good eye right there. The 2-1. 3-1. No score, just getting started. Top of the first. The it's with that same slider that he hit earlier. Three two. That's gone. Goodbye. One nothing Padres. Number twenty eight on the year. Let's freaking go. Come on, Alex. Cuidado, piso mojado. 431 out to right. That was a terrible pitch. Typically don't get away with making a mistake like that. And right there, he made him pay. Alex McKenna, the next to hit. Mackenzie Gore on the mound for us. We gotta win. And a ball in two strikes. We gotta win with Mackenzie Gore. Out to short. Toss two down. To first, and that is out number two. Out of the fourth. So digging in now for San Diego, Alex Parker. And here comes. So a shot in the last at bat, and this one's hit really well. It's a leadoff double. Kind of misplayed it, but we'll stay here at second. Well, it's hit really hard. Our 51st double of the season. Fernando Tatis Jr. to hit here. One of the elite home run hitters in the league this year. I thought it was on the ground. The no chance to get back. It's a double play. One out. Runner at second. Next up for the Diamondbacks, R.D. Gold. 
The 0 1. Parker fires over to first. That's the second out. One down. Alex Parker, the next up for the Padres. First pitch, and he just missed. One out. Always tough to turn two on a speedster like this. It's even harder with him coming out of the left-handed batter's box. You really need something to hit hard on the ground that they can handle two to turn two quickly. And this is in the call again, so it's 3 0. We'll take all the way. We're 2 for 2 today. After an 0 for, 0 for 10 stretch. Finally get a couple hits, and they're big ones. It's a great slider, 3-2. A lot of confidence there to throw that. Popped us up. Back down it, man. Can't even get a walk. And there's two away. <sighs> Two nothing, us, but scary times as we have two on nobody out. Justin Green, what is this? Isn't Dustin Green? I'm thinking of Dustin Harris for the Reds or the Cubs now. Which one is he on? I don't know, but he's good. This is not him. I thought he might have got traded. That's on the ground. The dude running the second can really fly. He won't get there, and we have turned a double play. Good job, Ayala. Here in the eight, base hit would be nice, wouldn't it? Oh, I thought I was on it. I was timing wise. I thought we were gonna shoot that thing back up the middle. Costa's not too fast though. Thirty-seven, over thirty-seven thousand in attendance here. Here to watch Alex. <laughs> it's gone two low breaking balls. And he goes outside fastball. We do get to and foul it off. We're good. One, two. Next offering is down low. This guy's a fun guy to watch taking it bad. He just battles up there. He doesn't take a pitch off at all. Makes it so difficult. That was disgusting. Guy. Just missed three two. With how long it takes to put him away. A bad umpire would call that. Here comes a three two. And to left, it's going to put a runner at third. Costa's going to try. Pull him off the plate. Pull him off the plate. Get there, buddy. Yes, sir. It's an RBI single for Alex. Big time. Big at bat to pad their lead up to three. Three nice nothing Padres. The they will walk Tatis. The ball. So That's a big hit because, I mean, in, insurance here in the last couple innings with a weaker bullpen. That's big. We're looking at possibly a four and one episode here, which would be huge. I think it was a calculated oh, I'm dead. We'll see how it pays off here. In the dirt. Thought I was dead in the water. Behind the plate there. Activity in the Arizona Bowl. How big of a deal did they sign Jazz Chisholm to? He's an 89 overall still. Um, he's pretty good. I mean, they've had him for four years, and they've got him for just this one year left. Uh, who knows what he'll sign in the future, but a decent year or a decent career for him. He's all right in the field. He's put up a career war of 20, so. Hey. The cover athlete is all right. 2-2 to Austin Meadows. Come on, bud. He struck out. But we leave 3 nothing on a big hit from Alex Parker. Jose Alvarado. Dustin Green. Shot it. Caught. Two down. Big play, JT Schwartz. And we win it. Three nothing, man. Let's freaking go. Yeah!
Like, come on now. Much needed, Alex, with a pretty decent episode. When a couple, three games of his, he got a multi-hit games, but those two that we didn't, over four and over five. So, a three twenty-one average, but a six RBI day. Um, we're getting closer to that thousand OPS again. We're also like really close on the batting title. Uh, if we're gonna hold on to that, Tatis is right back in this man. Good for him, but it's gonna go to Kelnick. Somehow, Jared Kelnick. And Dustin Harris, there he is. He plays for the Reds. And he did play for Chicago, so I wasn't wrong. Yeah, we've got the batting title right now by five points over St. Louis's Jordan Walker. And the Dodgers' Eloy Jimenez. Who's putting together, by the way, a Hall of Fame career. <laughs> Depends how long he can play. Um, Hank Aaron aboard. We're actually in that, but we're not winning that. We're not in the gold glove. We probably got the shortstop silver slugger thing. Yeah. Is O'Neill Cruz still a thing? Like, is he still playing with the Rockies? Other way, apparently. O'Neill Cruz. O'Neill Cruz. O'Neill Cruz. Oh, wait. He's a 91. And yeah, he is. He's just not hitting as well as he did in the last couple of years. 789 OPS. He's actually decent in the field. In 8.7 war last year? <laughs> Dang. It's because he was great in the field. He's got a 5 war again this year. He's put together a good career. As has Rafael Devers. Jeez, man. Jeez, man. Dang, Devers. He's only 34. He's still got 3 years in the tank. But that power perk clearly, clearly uh, needs to stay. Benny Montgomery down here. This dude's always a high war player. Not this year, but usually. <laughs> Either way, uh, big time day from the Padres going on a four-game win streak. We're 78-71. We're not going to catch the Dodgers, but we have tied up the Giants. And the Phillies and the Marlins are both... They're a half game ahead of us. Right? Yeah. They're a half game ahead of us. So it's real tight there between these four teams still on who's going to take that second wild card spot. And the Cardinals have lost three in a row. I don't know, man. Seems like there's a chance. You say So you're saying there's a chance. <laughs> uh, that'd be nice. We are on September 14th. We have exactly six, six, 13. 13 games left. So... A lot of them are at home. Our big series, our like huge series versus San Francisco is on the road. But every series from here on out is huge. If we can go get the sweep, that would be huge. Home against Colorado, got to win those. Got to win against Chicago. And the Giants series is a must win. Uh, and then LA is going to be a must win too. When you're competing with four teams, you can't, there's no room for air. If you like the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. That's it for me. That's Alex Parker, episode 393 in the books.